Hey family, I came on to show you guys my beautiful blessings that I received for Christmas. Now, I know that today is the 4th of December and Christmas is not here yet, but I've been blessed with some beautiful, beautiful gifts and prizes already. And um, a lot of the stuff I got on Black Friday for me, um, I'm not going to show my the things that I got for my children because I just don't want to. It's not really their channel. You know, I mean, what good would it do really? People really want to see what Tina got for Tina. Um, Christmas time, when I do the full fiasco, the full spread with the, you know, mistletoe and ho, ho, ho and, uh, Old Christmas tree and Kris Kringle and Temptations Christmas. When it's all laid out, I will show you um, what we blessed our children with. But for now, these are the blessings that I received for Christmas time. So I want to go through um, one by one and just merely show you guys. Okay, the first thing I want to show you is I got the Canon Rebel T3i. Um, I have not done anything with it because I'm intimidated by such camera. I'm so intimidated by it. Let me show you what I did. Okay. Now, initially, because the TI was just something that I felt like, uh, it's a little intimidating. I really don't want to go that deep. You know what I mean? And so, that's what Senior got me. Um, but me... On Black Friday, I bought the Nikon Coolpix um, L310, and so now I'm just going to take it back and get my money back because I don't need it. Um, it has not, you can tell that it hasn't really been open, really. Um, you know, I don't want to really agitate it too much because it's going back to the store. And, you know, stores really trip when it comes down to electronics on taking electronics back so um i don't want to agitate it too tough because this one is going back i don't need this one and so and then i bought this one because i was like you know let me see which one i want i didn't know but since i was at the store i was like you know what i'm gonna just buy this one um so i bought two in one day two different cameras and um because i was like in case i don't like that one because i didn't um, check the reviews or anything while I was out and about in the street. So, being that I didn't check the reviews on it, I was like, okay, well, you know, I'll just buy it now. I'll take it home. And if I don't like it or if it don't fit for me, then I will just bring it back, you know, and get my money back. So, this one here is the Olympus um, FZ14. So, I don't know. That one is going back too. Let me show you guys that it's still new and it has not been really agitated and this one actually came with a little memory get down four gigs that's not enough for me but anyway so that's what this is oh i didn't show you guys the inside and it comes with that or whatever but i didn't do anything with it because i was like you know what uh i don't know so um senior was like T, you are so worth me getting you this. So when he got me this, I was like, oh my God, Joe Day. Because this is actually Jody's, you know, this is what Jody wanted. And for it to be given to me, I felt a little bit like, uh, uh, you know what I mean? Like, because I know my girl wanted this camera so bad and for it to just be gifted to me, I just felt like, you know, uh, I was like, I don't know if I, you know, how I should feel because I know that she wanted this camera so badly. So let's see what it's working with in here. Um, because I have not taken a look at it. Okay, it's different softwares and stuff. And then we got the the big booklet. Um, okay, this is my Canon strap. Let's see. Let's see the Kahuka. 
So guys, I am going to, my point is to do better videos for you guys. Um, now that my channel is, you know, I'm, you know, respectfully, I've been able to put out a, a few videos. So now it's time for me to kind of up my game and do better quality videos, shall I say, you know, humbly. Um, but this is my new baby here. I don't know how to work this girly, but he got me the bag and got me an, an extra... <clears throat> He got me an extra, um, what you call it? So I got an extra lens too. So well all right. 75 to 300 mm. Okay. So I got that with it too. So we're gonna navigate through this guy and figure out how to work it and all those kinds of things because I'm gonna need y'all to help me with that because I don't know how to work this. I'm just a little bit intimidated by it. Um, I'm not one, I really don't like to read directions and I know that that's bad, but I don't read directions. I'm like a trial and error person and it gets to everybody around me because they're like, why don't you read the directions? You're just gonna mess something up by just doing it the way you're doing it. You're not doing it right. So, cause I don't never read the directions. I'm always okay. You know, somebody else read the directions and tell me what I'm doing wrong. I just don't read the directions. So, anyway, let's put her in here because I don't want it to be all messed up. Okay, maybe this stays like this. This right here, I gotta give you a name, mama. What are we gonna call you? Miss Cannon? Maybe? Miss Cannon? I think? Yeah, maybe I'll call you Miss Cannon. I'll give my stuff names. It just is what it is. I know you guys are not trying to see me do all this, but you guys will wanna see what you know what you wanna see. So let's just put that in there somewhere. And we'll just, I'll just go through this some other time or something. Let's just set this here. And, okay. Now, the next thing I got really, really quickly. Oh, I got some shoes. I got some shoes. I can't walk in them, but they were gifted. So, that's all I'm going to say about that. So, I got those shoes. I don't know how to walk in them, y'all. So, but I guess they're going to be just for show because I don't know how to walk in them. I did get a, 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 a wireless printer. Um, I got a, a shredder because I accumulate so many papers. Um, and so it's like, okay, I need to start throwing away, you know, so many. I, I keep documents for like forever. And I always keep, I mean, I have like old tax returns from like the 90s that I just never got rid of. In the garage, I got like boxes, like old file boxes of like old, um, like when we were renters. Um, I, I still got like all my receipts from, you know, paying rent and stuff like that. I just kept that shit. And I've been in this house since 90. Tioni just turned 13. I was in my nine months of pregnancy when um, Tony bought me this house. And I've been here ever since, but I still got rental receipts from all like back then that's crazy so i needed a, a shredder so i ended up getting a shredder um i got the clarisonic i got the clarisonic mia 2. um i'm going to do a oh 
And you know, I, of course, they had to, what? Get me leopard. I had to get leopard. Um, I am going to do a video on this because I also got this one too. It's like a knockoff from the Clarisonic. This one is called ProSonic or something. And it's merely a knockoff. And so, and this one does face and body and the Mia primarily does face. So before I, you know, upgrade and get the bigger Sonic, I wanted to see, you know, what this guy here is gonna do for me, if this would just be enough. So, um, I don't know yet. I don't know if that's gonna be enough or not. But um, I've been using um, Mia um, for about a week now. And uh, let me drink some water, y'all. I've been trying to drink my water. I've been trying to do good. Hold on. Excuse me. Okay. Um, I've been, you know, using it for about a week. And I wanted to, you know, ensure that, you know, it is what it is. You know, before I come in and be like, oh, but y'all, this Clarisonic, boop, 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 boop. So I wanted to, you know, kind of try it out a little bit first before I just, you know, uh, scream it out. Next thing I ended up getting was a soda stream. I don't know how to work it yet, but I will do a full review on that. I got the new um, Keurig. I already have a Keurig already, but I wanted a new one because the new ones came in deluxe models. So the Keurig that I have over there is not the Deluxe. I wanted the Deluxe. So guess what? They had a new one came out. I like the product so much. I had to upgrade and get the newer one. So, and I have this one in cinnamon. Okay, so I got a new Keurig. Uh, Donatella, you ready for this? I got a new 17 inch laptop by Dell. This is my new pinky. Uh, it has a, a i7 um, core processor in it. Um, I have a terabyte in my laptop. Now, you guys um, know that I have bought um, an external drive with two terabytes in it because with all my videos, I have to take them off. I had to take them off my other pinky and put them on um, external drive to free up space because I was just running out of space all the time. So this time we got a terabyte in it. So then therefore, boom, when I, you know, I got a lot of room to do all kinds of things. As a matter of fact, today I took my, um, my iPad and I hooked it up here and I just transferred everything over here. Now on my iPad and on my iPod, I have the iPod touch 64 gig. Now for my iPod touch 64 gig, I have... 6,900 plus songs on my iPad and on my iPod. So with that being said, and it was like 25 gigs worth of music. So, you know, I need something with a big hard drive, big memory, all that kinds of stuff. So to get this one, it was well worth it. It was a little pricey. Um, I don't want to, you know, price drop on shit like this because, you know, some people might feel a particular kind of way. This is not that type of video. I'm not trying to flow show or front on anybody. Everybody do what they can afford to do. And what you can't afford to do, you just stay in your lane. That's it. This is not to make a mockery. So let me just clarify that right now before people get started. I'm able to do what I'm able to do. You do what you can afford to do and that's it. But um, it does have um, the Core i7 in it. Um, I think Core comes i3s. Then the i5s and the i7s, and I also have Windows 8 on it as well. It has a Blu-ray on it. Y'all, I mean, this, you know, for me, when, for a long time, and Tony has also made me this way, as well as my parents, when they buy items, they want the best that they got when they buy them. You know what I'm saying? And so, and I guess it trickled down to me, and I guess my kids will probably hold on to that too, but with my kids now, I'm trying to, you know, corral them off of so much stuff, you know what I mean? And, and now that we put them on this point system, they have to earn things. Yes, we're buying them a lot, we bought them some really, really cool shit, but they also have to earn it. See, I'm here by myself, so I'm able to talk about it, but 
you um bottom line is core uh i7 um the new pinky this is the shit uh i have not really gotten into her real real good and tough so i don't know too much about windows 8 on my other one i had vista so i definitely don't know anything about eight like eight like for real eight so okay so that's that um lastly oh oh and i did i got a program i got photoshop adobe photoshop 11 um and come to find out i got the wrong one because i want the photoshop elements 11 with premiere and this one does not have the premiere in it so um i'm gonna take it back but this you know black friday i couldn't pass up the deal so i'm going to take this back and just exchange it and pay the difference for the um the one with premiere for the to to edit my videos i don't know too much about editing software i did um you know, kind of go back and forth with this young, one young lady. Is it Chelsea? Is your name Chelsea, mama? Real cute, y'all. She got these dreads. Um, you know, she's a YouTube guru. She's been on here for a minute. And the girl is bad. I just really just love her spirit. And um, she was telling me to get the, um, the premiere. And I was telling her, I said, well, I got it. And so, but when I was showing it, this is the one I got. And this is not the right one. So... Um, I'm just going to take it back to the store and pay the difference for the one that I really, really want. Okay, now, for my gift that I'm really, really digging. Are y'all ready for this shit? Are you ready? Check it out. Okay. I got Miss Margarita Veal. Okay. This girl right here, family, when I tell you she makes 48 different margaritas, I don't even drink. The last drink I had was in the summertime. I had a, uh, hold on, don't tell me. I had um, a mudslide, okay? I had a mudslide, a little bitty small one. Took me all day to drink it. I was at the jazz festival, uh, Pomona Jazz Festival. The one that had John B, it was John B, um, Case, um, Bomb, Angela Wynn Bush, me and Kenny, I had the yellow jumpsuit on, the pictures is on Facebook. That day, I had a, um, um, a mudslide, and that was the last drink I've had. I have not had a drink since then. Um, Jody has sent me, like, bottles of different liquors and stuff. I really don't know liquor. She sent me a, a thing of Stella Rosa. Something she sent me some to uh toku tuko toku anyway Kenny calls it cuckoo so um she sent me a bottle of that like a pyramid bottle some beautiful drinks and things that I'm not hip on I just don't know so to get this really this is gonna be for dinner parties that I'm gonna start hosting dinner parties at my home and my cousins and my girls and everybody come over and we're gonna sit around and we're gonna have a couple of sips and you know and shit like that there um I got some things coming down the tailpike I um, I'm gonna keep this house probably gonna buy a bigger home we'll see I don't want to talk about it I don't want to bring it I, you know it's already in the universe but I don't want to speak on it right now so anyway um, but this one right here is called a margarita bill. It makes 48 different drinks, ladies. 48 different drinks. Do you understand me? Okay, right here in this right here, you put vodka, tequila, or rum in this uh, canister here. And this one is cranberry juice, sour mix. Okay, cranberry juice in this one. Can you use cran grape? Because I like cran grape. I don't like regular cranberry juice. Can I kind of tweak it a little bit? Would it mess it up? Okay. I like cranberry. I don't like cranberry juice. Okay, so then, and then sour mix, last night, was it last night? Or the night before last, Tony, I mean, excuse me, not Tony, Lord. <laughs> Kenny and Jody were um, trying to, you know, make me understand this sour thing because I don't like sour stuff. So I was like, well, can I put something sweet in there instead of sour? And then this right here is orange juice. I don't like orange juice. I like pineapple juice. I mean, it does make my tongue itch a little bit, 
but I do like I do like pineapple juice. So my thing is, can I kind of tweak these? Y'all let me know. I don't know for anybody that has this particular machine. Let me open it up and show you guys what it um because I haven't even when I bought it, I just I got it on Black Friday and that remember when I was sleep out in the car and all that and I had went to the bed back and beyond over there in that area. They didn't have it, but the store in my area had it. And a lot of places were doing special order on this because this is a new item that has just, you know, come down the tailpipe or whatever. So it's new. So a lot of stores don't have it just yet. But, uh, oh, oh, see, I ain't even looked at it, y'all. Actually, it's been over to Kenny's house, and he was wanting to keep it at his house. I'm like, it's... Are you serious right now? You better give me my toy so I can take my toy home. You know, because of course I didn't want the kids, you know, things here at the house. And so and I, so I took a lot of things to his house to keep the kids from, you know, rambling and going in shit. But, oh my God. Let's see. Wow. Okay. And so this is her. It's not that heavy at all. Uh, it's a little heavy, but not too bad. And I, the next thing I would like to know about it, though, I am going to do a full uh, review on it. Don't worry. Um, I wanted to know how much does these things hold. I wanted to know... How much does each canister hold? You know, I mean, like, can you put, like, you know, one of them big bottles, small bottle? I mean, you know, I like to know how much does this hold? Because I don't know that. Um, so, yeah, so that's this girly right here. Um, let's see, I think this one. Wait a minute. Did I have? Okay. This goes first. Right? And then here's my handy dandy booklet. Okay, then this. Yeah. Okay, then this. I don't want to really mess with it too tough until I get ready to use it because I don't want it, you know, I don't want it all stuffed up and jacked up and stuff. And I want to sit it on my counter and everything. And so, but anyway, let me let me go over the different drinks that it makes. Um, this right here is a recipe, um, a recipe, I mean, not a recipe. Well, I guess it is. It's a menu, okay? And you cut it out, and, and it tells you the different drinks. I'm going to go through them really, really fast. You ready? Real quick. Okay. Now, with vodka, it made vodka shots, ruby punch, Russia, Russian Rita, Cape Cod, Pran, powder, screwdriver, sour berry, cranberry toad, key west screwdriver, sucker punch, sunset punch, madras, party punch, sweet tart, vodka sunburst, and um, pink lemonade. With the rum, it has all, I don't want to go through this, y'all going to be like, bitch, whatever. Okay, but let me see what's on here that might be, I don't know. They do have a hurricane on there. I don't know, drink, so uh, whatever. It has, so what it does, let me tell you what it do. You put your cup up under here with some ice in your cup. You set your cup up under there and you turn this knob. This is the LCD screen. You turn the knob to whatever drink that you want to do. So what you're going to do is, okay, if everybody is getting down with tequila, then this will be just full of tequila. Then once you're done with tequila and everybody want to drink rum, I guess, then you fill this with rum. So whatever you're doing, like if it's a, if it's a tequila, like I'm going to do taco tequila night, right? So on my taco tequila night, that's all we're having is tequila. So I'll buy a nice, I would like a nice tequila, not no, just no bullshit, not no store brand old okie doke. No, give me some, you know, some shit that just left from the border type, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, give me some real proper tequila, and um, I'm going to confer with my girl because she knows about that. And then um, 
I put that in there. And then they just turn this to whatever drink they want, and then it's going to automatically make it. Now, if you want it stronger, there's a button here that you can press. If you want more tequila in your drink than regular, then you just, I guess, hit that button. Over here, it says, I feel lucky. So you just, boom, hit that button, and it'll just come out with a, you know, whatever tequila drink that, you know, whatever drink that it comes up with, it just mixes you a drink, and so that's what that is. So anyway, I am going to do a review on that when I, you know, get the rum and whatever else um, and put it all together. But anyway, family, I just wanted to say thank you so much for being so patient with me. I know you guys are like, um, are you going because I was really weighing whether or not I should do this or not. And then last night, Kane sent me a message, and so she was like, I'm looking forward to, you know, to you doing your haul or whatever. And I was like, okay, well then, let me go on and let me just go on and do it. And I had been talking to Jody, like, Jody, should I do it? Like, because Jody already knows. So I was like, okay, well, Jody, should I do it or should I, should I, should I, should I, should I? And she was like, girl, please, this is your channel. You do what you want to do on your channel. People don't like it. They don't have to watch it. That's it. So I guess that's just it. It is what it is. On that note, family, from my Mikasa to your Mikasa, I love you and you guys have a wonderful holiday. Bye-bye.